It has been a crazy 24 hours and the sun the crazy continues. Last night, severe weather causing a whole lot of damage in an East Texas school district. KTK's known in Hoffman right now was there in Hopkins County all day long. With a look at all the destruction there and efforts, they could be months away. Nolan. Neil, school officials are looking at the damage from the storms last night at Como Picton CISD. Last night, severe storms leaving some of East Texas scrambling. We didn't realize that it was, you know, that bad. The school district of Como Picton CISD saying it's devastated with the amount of damage following strong storms overnight. There is some damage uh, for the entire campus. There's, there are some rooms, whether it's uh, holes in the roofs, where the air conditioners have been ripped off the roof or uh, flooding. Around campus, you will find bent metal, pieces of torn down buildings, and roofs that have been blown off their foundation, with the backside of the school seeing the worst of it. Some facilities are destroyed and unusable. The assistant superintendent for the district, Lydia Walden, said they took a direct hit. There's tremendous amount of damage, uh, extremely a large amount of damage. Coaches from the football programs even on scene throughout Friday going through buildings trying to salvage anything they can. Walden added the community is strong and will be back better than ever. We're a very resilient community, uh, very family oriented um, and we'll we'll be back and we'll be ready for school. I'm not sure exactly what day that's going to be yet, but our hopes are we have the faith that we're going to make it. Luckily, nobody was inside or near the building during the storms, all athletic activities have also been canceled until further notice. And I was told today disaster relief officials have already been at the scene and will continue to assess the damage throughout the following days. Reporting live in studio, Nolan Huffman, KETK News.